from Earlham College head coach Steve Sakrasitz and student athletes Howie Smith and Eric Elkus. Coach, your opening remarks. Well, uh, first off, um, you know, great game by Howie uh, on the mound today, um, doing what he's done all year for us, dominate the strike zone, um, you know, keeping guys off balance, um, allowing our defense to make plays behind him, keeping our defense on our toes because works as quick as he does, um, and that's the expectation we have for how in our pitching staff goes. Eric Elkis, um, you know, the ball that he got up in the air today, having the, the home run and the RBIs he's had, um, is something that this young man has done for four years for us and you know both these uh, players are are seniors for us with the other seniors we have here and um, you know I I thought our team played very loose I thought our team was very uh, obviously excited about being the opportunity but the opportunity didn't overwhelm us so um, very excited about how our kids played and uh, you know getting that first one to get us in the winner's bracket uh, moving on to tomorrow. Uh, it feels great. Um, you know, the thing we talked about our kids all the time is, you know, our expectation is we're going to win. Um, you know, I, I think that comes from the top down about believing in it, and you have to believe in what you have. And um, we play a type of baseball; it's aggressive, play hard all the time. Um, you're not always going to get the three-run home run. You're if you, but if you hustle out of the box, you put pressure on the defense. They're going to worry about our base runners a lot, and we get pitches that we're able to drive the baseball out. And um, you know, to be part of a, a group of seniors that have led us all year, um, that came in and their freshman year was our first winning season in 43 years. Now we're looking their senior year, conference championship, regular season, postseason championship. Now NCAA tournament win. Um, you know, we've got a good ball club, and it's very exciting about where we're at. But we still have expectations to move on this thing and, and continue um, to open some eyes around the nation about what Orlando college baseball is about. Do you feel like you were a little bit more relaxed coming as a lower seed? Um, well, I mean, you can look at it and say there's not much pressure on you. And pressure is something you put on yourself if you're not prepared. Our kids are prepared. Our coaching staff's prepared. It's just a different venue that we haven't been in. You know, we've been playing some tight games, some tough games here going into the conference tournament. And, um, you know, I thought our group did a great job of going out there, um, again, not playing in the moment, just letting the game go to ourselves. And I thought we did a good, jam- game, uh, good job on that. Uh, yeah, definitely. First and foremost, I just want to thank God for giving us another day to be out here to play baseball, um, sending his son Jesus down the cross for our sins. Um, but today, I felt really good in the bullpen. Um, I've got confidence against anybody. Um, I was able to locate three pitches in the zone um, pretty much any time we want. Threw a lot of 3-1 off speed, 3-2 um, off speed throughout the entire game. Um, they were in a good offensive club. They were hunting fastballs. We learned that early on, and we were able to make an adjustment there. And uh, what's your base loaded in the bottom of the sixth inning? You were able to get it out of that. What were you kind of looking in that for the fans? Uh, yeah, definitely. Just locating, uh, locating in the zone. Um, didn't want to walk a guy, give free bases, just staying on the corners of the plate, no matter what pitch you're throwing, just trying to live on the corners. Uh, it means a lot to me to be able to help out the team. Uh, you know, the record's a cool thing to achieve. Uh, but we're just trying to put up some runs for Howie. He doesn't need, he, he never needs a lot. Uh, if we if we have a quality start uh, out of our uh, pitching staff, uh, it's gonna, we're going to be a tough team to beat. So we're just going to try to scratch as many uh, runs across the plate as we can. And uh, Howie did Howie performed great today, just like he always does. Uh, and we were able to get a win. Uh, our guys are a lax group. Um, there's a bunch of characters in this group in general, so I wasn't worried about that. It's obviously just going back out there, and um, you know, you could say momentum could flip back to the other side. They're bringing a new guy in, um, but you know, our guys have stayed with the process. Um, you know, we knew we had you know our at bat, then plus going out there, Walter going out with a four, at least a four run lead. Um, yeah, I like our chances in that. Uh, we just had to sit down and wait a little bit longer for uh, us to get that victory. It's a great thing. Um, you know, the, these guys, they just don't want it to end for them. And I don't want it to end for them either. They want to keep playing as long as they possibly can to put ourselves, you know, 
in the best position to not only get ourselves into the regional, win the regional, move on, if that's something that we're able to do. But we're going to give everything our got. And it starts with the seniors because they pass that uh, uh, philosophy down to our younger players. They see how they go about their business. And it, it's something that, you know, again, as we talk in our program, it's earned, not given. They've earned every opportunity that we've gotten in this program, where we're at. And, and again, as we told the guys the end of the day, we did get that 30 record, but let's go ahead and get 31 tomorrow and keep this thing rolling. Any other questions for Coach or student athletes? Yeah, one question for Eric and Holly. Um, the last month, you guys have been really on a tear, playing really well. Uh, but at one point, um, you're sitting five and five in the conference, and you know I asked Coach Sack this: uh, the the chance to host the conference tournament dwindled, and now here you are. You host conference tournament, won the conference tournament, and now you won the NCAA tournament for the first time in school history. Talk about sort of your guys' ride the last month. Yeah, um, I think that a lot of that is um, us being able to uh, absolutely play against the game. And it doesn't matter who's in the other dugout as long as we play our game. Um, and I think that that has a lot to do with a lot, a lot of our success the last month is uh, not worrying who's in the other dugout, just going out there and playing the game of baseball, which most of us have played the last 15 years. Uh, yeah, definitely. I think Elka said it right when we we're just playing against the game. Um, we've always got a lot of confidence no matter who we're going to play. Um, but championship teams find a way to win. And no matter what the situation, just responding. If they hit you in the mouth, you got to hit them right back. Um, just finding a way to get the job done.